Welcome back to Northgard. So we're playing with the official release version of the game, which means the maps will be procedurally generated, as well as I want to play with another faction and try out different strategies. So we're going to play as these Ram Vikings here, which is appropriate because they start off with three sheep. Uh, so, I, well, I don't really know why, but anyways, they start off with three sheep. Uh, also, our clan members eat 5% less food. That's great because that food could be put into trading. It could be used for colonizing. It could be used for uh, feasts. So all pretty kind of fun things. So as I said in the intro, we've got procedurally generated maps. I have no idea where we're going to spawn. Uh, the preview builds, the kind of demo builds had everyone starting off in kind of the same area. Uh, that's not the case anymore, which makes the game significantly harder. And this is normal difficulty. I feel like I kind of have an idea of, of how we can make this happen. Uh, we have like a little beach start here, which is nice. Okay, the first thing I want to do is let's get up. Well, we probably want a house. Uh, I definitely want a scout. Let's, let's get a scout. We got to start figuring out some things. Uh, we're consuming less food, so hopefully, hopefully we, uh, we can colonize more regions earlier on. Um, so I'm, so here's the thing, what I, what I'd ideally like is to find a forest nearby, because the forest allows us to get like 20% extra wood from the, from the woodcutter's lodge, something like that, I don't, I don't really know, but, uh, I don't want to cut too much wood. Now, in the, like, in my first playthrough of this game, I, I made like, I had like 2,000 wood, something stupid, and uh, and I realized that was super inefficient, that was really dumb, so we don't want to do that. Uh, whoa, whoa, I did not mean to have all those scouts. Well, I, I've got three scouts right now, and now we're not, okay, yeah, hold on, we only need one, we only need one, so <laughs> that's fine, that's fine, you guys continue to give me food. Uh, again, we start off with three sheep, and uh, we can always slaughter this sheep, in, you know, if we want to. I could slaughter them in the winter if we're running out a lot of food. You know, I, I am Cracklord is not afraid to to, shot, to not slaughter to slaughter any sheep. Uh, I'm, that sounds horrible. I know. I'm sorry. I actually wouldn't like to slaughter the sheep because there is a nice building here, uh, sheepfold, it allows you to enclose your sheep to produce food. That's something that I want to get up early. That way we can hopefully produce even more food. Uh, and one kind of important strategy, especially with this kind of coastal start, that I want to explore is I, I want to build like some ships, man. I didn't get to experiment with the, with the ships my, my first time around. I don't even know where it's at right now, but... Oh, right there. Long ship? I don't know. Something like that. Okay, so what's over here? What do we got? What do we got? So we've got three building slots, uh, some meat so we can put a hunter over there. Uh, nothing dangerous. I mean, that's fine. I mean, I'll colonize it right now. It's only 20 food. So let's, let's do that. And uh, when did we get another person? 59%. Okay. Yeah, and we probably want to build a house because we're at four or five. So let's go ahead and build a house. You know, let's build it over here. You've got enough building slots. And I'll take somebody and, you know, send you over there. That way, because I'd like to keep, like, this is like my main plot of land. I'd like to keep this open for a lot of sexy things that I want to build throughout this campaign. I don't know why it has to be sexy, but I'm just saying. I I'd like to use a lot of things. Uh, oh, yeah, we're going to need a woodcutter, obviously, too. I think we start off with more wood than usual, so that, that helps. Okay, well, as long as I have, uh, okay, it's only 50. What's over here? Any forests? Fertile land. Okay, well, that's awesome. Actually, that's really awesome, too. All right, well, then I am going to be forced to uh, begin the woodcutter here. And, uh, okay, so someone's already out there. Let's see here. I can colonize this for 40. We're only doing plus two food. What's up with that? Is it because, yeah, well, we got a house up, so that's important. Okay, well, you go gather us some food. I think that's a that's a good deal. We might so we obviously get to plant some farms for the first time. We didn't do that the first time around. I don't know what the heck I was doing the first time around. And we have a source of stone, so I put up a mine here, and we can uh, we can exploit this region's resources. That sounds fun. It sounds great. No one in history has ever done that before, so uh, we'll be the first for sure. Okay, let's let's colonize. It's only forty. Let's just do it now. Um, we we increase our happiness too by colonizing stuff. Whoa, what is this? Oh, ruins. Okay. So there's one wolf there. Wolves are not much of an enemy at all. So this is a really weird start. Uh, I am in a weird start because we're kind of cornered off here with these cliffs. I have I've I've done multiple kind of you know just kind of testing out the full release uh, before this video. This is strange. A lot of coast coastline, which is kind of cool. We might be able to explore explore like fishing fishing fishing. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. Fishing. That's how we say it in in the Ram in the Ram Viking culture, so I don't know about you guys, but <laughs> that's just what I'm saying it now. I don't even see, are there, oh, there's wolves up here. I don't see the really, really hardcore, like, barbarian-esque guys, those little skeleton dudes. I don't see them. 
Okay, so we need to be careful. Obviously, the wolves will be sending at us some baddies. Uh, how much? So I'm at 455 wood right now. It costs 80 to get up a training camp. I don't even know if we have enough people for a training camp at the moment. A mine. I wouldn't mind a mine. You know, we're doing crowns, but again, crowns cost... Crowns are going to go down with building upkeep, so uh, all these things we got to keep in mind. Hopefully there's something cool over here. Uh, but I think the number one priority is just getting up at least... Oh, here they come. I hope there's enough people to help him out, because... Yeah, I think we're fine. We're going to get lucky. Okay, so when is winter? Okay, we're, we're about midway through the season. Um, we'll probably build the training camp, probably in the home, our home territory. Not make it too complicated. All right, let's see what's over here. I'm, I imagine we'll probably see our first AI, right? Pro probably. No. Oh, what are these? Oh my gosh, there's a ton of meat over here. Well, technically, yeah, just zero of two. It's always, it's going to be the same. Now, I'm really tempted to colonize this land, but I shouldn't do it, not until I have some sort of an army. That'd be kind of bad, especially if there is, in fact, somebody over here waiting. Uh, so let's, we've got, we've got enough wood, finally. Let's go ahead and throw down a training camp, probably here. Uh, wait a second, what happened? Oh, we did. Okay, never mind. I, 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 for some reason, I don't know, I cracked out. I thought we didn't have control of this land. We, we, we do. We do. Okay, so what is over here? So there is a person. There's a person right there. So they might take this from us. How important is this? Well, they won't take this. Well, this, uh, this is like a little wolf, yeah, wolf cave. So that'll be tough to, to colonize. A little bit tougher to colonize, at least. Um, tell me this is not going to take long. So this is one wolf. We can take that one wolf down. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off on it because I know that if I expand too quickly, that's it's really going to uh, just just ask for the AI to come kick my kick my butt. And uh, I'm not trying to get my butt kicked in every single game that I play. I'd like to look somewhat like I know what I what I'm doing, but that's that's hard. That's hard to do. Um, I think as this this Ram faction too. I think that our healers heal faster or something like that. We'll, we'll see when we get enough lore because um, we get like to see these little things. That shows like it's specific to our faction. Yeah, increases your healer's healing speed to 200%. And then uh, this is how we can reduce consumption of food by 5%. Okay, so I don't have that automatically. But uh, we'll, get, we'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get it there. Okay, so here we go. Uh, I am going to probably just do two. And hopefully healthy dudes. So this is going to cost me crowns. I can't just do it freely. Um, Alright, let's move in. So I don't have to also like click multiple times anymore, which is great to get everyone to go over. That was so frustrating. That was super frustrating. Okay, so we're gonna colonize this because I'm at 200. And, yeah, 200 food. Oh man, this is gonna cost like how much? 120. Oh, that's a risk. Can they even call? Can they technically? I don't think they can. Can they reach diagonally? I don't know. Well, we're gonna find these new people. So bam, o, oh, bam, o, oh, perfect. Okay, so we've established a meeting. Let me go get my scout and tell him to explore in here. Yeah, go over there, little scout, little buddy. You go ahead and do that. Uh, next up, let me send my warriors and say, come right here. Because we know that more than likely the wolves will attack over that way, probably. We need a healer. We need a healer. Oh, uh, man, I'm making... Yeah, we've got some food on hand, baby. We've got some food. You know, I, what I don't have that much of is, uh, is wood. And we probably need to... Yeah, let's go ahead and get another woodcutter. I am really thinking about going for it here. I mean, winter is just about to begin. Oh, yeah, that's bad too. Um, all right, let's go with let's go with the house here, I guess. All right, you know what? Crack Lord's gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Boom, right there. Let's do it. Let's colonize right before winter. Probably not the smartest of plans, but we're gonna we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. And uh, and if I need to, okay. So boom, let's come in there. Uh, yeah, we should be able to get through winter. I think we should still be able to get through winter, more than likely. And we're pretty much safe back here. That's why it feels, like, somewhat safe doing this, expanding so quickly, because no one's going to attack me from the cliffs. So, you know, we're relatively a pretty safe Viking faction uh, early on here. Okay, so uh, what are the next things that we need to build? We need just a lot more wood, man, because we have not been able to build. I need to get a mine. I need to start, you know, doing the mining thing. Um, oh, we got some lore. Okay, hold on. So what do you want to do? I actually wouldn't mind going sharper axes. Let's go sharp axes and then maybe cooking mastery first. Because we might not need to do any sort of military, too much military expansion just yet. Because we're in a pretty safe location. I really like this spot. So we can kind of stay in the corner, 
hide, maybe fish, learn some fishing. That's what I want to do. I want to learn how to fish. Maybe this ruin will show us some like cool things. I don't know. That's what I'm hoping for. I can organize a feast. Oh, so did the uh, the house get built? Um, oh no, it, no it's not because uh, you don't have anyone working on that, Drew. There you go. So the house is going to be built. And um, our scout has, oh, 100. No way. 100 crowns and 50 lore. Okay. That's still, that's really good. Yeah, I thought it was the other way around. But th either way, I'm still really happy with that. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get a mine. Um, yeah, let's do a mine right there. So right when you're done with that, let's actually just pull somebody over. Yeah, let's just... Let's pull someone over to go and start working on this. Um, house should be done soon. I want to do something with the fertile land. Or do we do we need that? I, is the fertile land really that important? Because I could just... I, I think this would be enough food. We're going to consume less food too. Alright, well, either way. So I'm, I'm getting more villagers. So ideally, we would be... Oh, they lost this. Oh, perfect. Okay, good, 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 good. That's great. Um... Now, if we take out this wolf cave, we get 30 fame. Uh, wolves will spawn in this area until you claim it. Uh, the longer we wait, the harder it will be. I, I don't have the villagers right now to, to even think about it. I probably need a big buff war chief to, to do this too. Probably do. How much would this cost to upgrade? Not that much, actually, because I'm going to get the stone like right now. Um, what are you guys doing, villager? Okay, well, come over here. Come over here and do your thing. Um, we would need a heal or two if we start going crazy crazy with armies at least uh, But I don't think that's a super big worry right now we're, we're losing a lot of food is winter almost over. Please tell me winter is almost over. <laughs> that would be great I have I have two woodcutters, and I'm not really making much wood, but that's fine uh, a trade route is gonna be important like right now because crowns are costing or building upkeep is, is starting to really Cut into some things here. I've got a lot of food back here, man. I have got plenty of food, and we consume less food, so I don't think food is going to be an issue. Oh, is this a lore? Ru uh, yes. This is one of those rune stones, so I can get a lore, lore master over here at any point. Uh, well, we're going to consume less food already. Nice. Okay. I like that. Okay, we. I'm. I'm feeling good about this one. I'm feeling good. Um. Maybe I should get up another wood cutter. I, I don't want to. I don't want to tell any warriors to become. Or I don't want to build any more warriors. You know, if I get up another encampment. Uh oh. Did anything burn down? I think we're fine. If I get up another uh, warband encampment thingy, we'd be, I think, really good. In terms of uh, taking out that wolf encampment thingy. Training camp. That's what I'm trying to say. Training camp, Drew. Just say training camp. <laughs> you can do it. Especially if I could build it here. I mean, how many slots? Two building slots? There's some stone over here. I think that would be a smart idea. Let's do it. Okay, so let's pull someone over here. Build that. Uh, I'm assuming that we're ma since we're making less... Since we're consuming less food, we'll be able to get out more builders. Uh, villagers, I should say. And uh, we'll just... Boom. We'll just take an army of six and take them all down. I think we could do it. Four wolves? I think we could do it. As long as we have the uh, the food to colonize this region afterwards. I'd like to colonize this region too, but that might be a little bit hard. No, that's not going to be too difficult. There's only one wolf. I don't know if the AI just dropped the ball or what What went down, AI? Can you please tell me what happened? Because that doesn't look too good. Uh, healer might also be something that is important, but... Uh, I think the first thing I need to I need to build the sheepfold just to guarantee that I'm super get set with food Yeah, so we didn't spawn this next to a forest. So that means that I'm I, I don't get that like nice bonus that I was talking about uh, What is up here? Yeah, we are cornered off. It is crazy um, Could be bad though. I mean we're forced into war if we want to win this campaign We're, we're pretty much forced into war because there's not this is not like amazing this this location isn't like it, you know Anything amazing. Oh, we're gonna need another house too. Oh, uh, where where are we being attacked from? Okay. So get over here. Don't let him die. Do not let him die. Bad. Who is over here? What are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. Um We actually have another slot open and there's nothing else over here, so yeah, we're gonna build the house here. Kind of unfortunate, but I think we need the house before before we need the food. Okay, so you're going to become a warrior with us. 
Let's get you all over here. Do I want to... Ooh. Trying to think, do I want more... Yeah, let's do one more. You're gonna come over here. You already hurt. We might we might lose you, but I think we're gonna do it too. Uh, what do we need? Like 80, 80 wood for this little guy? Yes. Okay, and that's when we'll that's when we'll probably attack. Our scout was hurt while exploring a new area. Well, I mean he's probably gonna die either way. <laughs> I hate to say it, I'm just saying. I don't necessarily hate to say it, but yeah. Do we have enough crowns to do this? I've got five warriors. Is this, do we know this is going to be worth it? Um, we actually don't know that, Drew, but we're still going to try it. Boom, okay, so I'm going to put that little guy right there. Uh, alright, well let's just jump into, we've got five, I don't see, I only see four, but I think we can handle it. Oi. Let's do it, oh yeah, we've got five, okay, so let's, let's see, come on baby. So there's a few ones that are hurt, they might be in kind of a difficult situation, but... Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Don't nobody die. Don't nobody die. We, we can get a healer out and fix a lot of things. Nice. So I colonize this for 160. Boom. I know I'm losing food right now, but uh, we should be able to fix that once we finish this little guy. Do I need to actually put a... What, what, what do you need for this? Do we know? I don't know, but we're going to be attacked. So we next agenda is to get out a healer healer's hut. Really important. Can you finish this, please? Okay, yeah, so we do need... Uh-oh, has discovered gates of... I think I know what that is. I think I know what that is. Okay, so you become this little guy. Do we want another one? Uh... Yeah, do whatever this tells you to do. I don't know what this is... What is this even meaning? Building with no workers. Okay, well, hold on. How much... I think a healer's hut costs like 80, right? I think, yeah, it, oh, it's 60, perfect. Let's get this out right now. And I'm gonna put this next to, we'll put it here. How many building slots are here? So we've got fish and iron, oh, perfect. Okay, we wanna mine over this way then. Um, let's get someone there to work on this. I don't know why this is telling me that I can't, I can move somebody there. Do I not have the, uh, do I need some sort of technology for it or something? I don't know. That's weird. But anyways, guys, I'm going to stop right there. Uh, pretty good episode so far. We took out the wolf camp, and uh, we need to get ready. I might even attack these guys just like right now. It looks like they're open. After we get the healer. After we get the healer, I think we'll be I think we'll be set. I think we're off to a pretty good start so far. We just need to manage uh, some of the territories a little bit better, and, uh, and we should be able to catch the AI, I think, beginning in the next video. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.